All right, son, you're up. What are you doing today? Uh, I'm just gonna go to the tennis courts for a little bit. You're going to the tennis courts? Yeah, yeah, but it's not what you think it is. Yeah, yeah, it's not like that at all. It's more like this. We just got to the courts. I'm at Brevard College right now and there's always security roaming around this area. I'm not sure how well this is gonna work out. Not sure if you can tell by all the pine trees, but I'm back in North Carolina in my hometown of Brevard. It's also pretty early in the morning right now, so I got this coffee, I'm trying to wake up. And the last thing I want is a pulled muscle. Wow, great moves. Keep it up. Proud of you. Oh. Oh. Why can't I do that? I've never been able to touch my toes. The next part of the process is some warm-up tricks. Hey man, no, no skateboards here. You're gonna you're gonna stay in the courts. Oh, I'm gonna stay them? Yeah, you're gonna mark up the courts. Sorry, man. Uh, you're gonna have to do it maybe in like a parking lot or something, but you can't, can't, can't skateboard here on the courts. Well, I just got kicked out before I could even skate the tennis nets, but I just wanna point something out. Do you see all those marks? None of those are for me. That's from tennis players out here. And just to let you know, I've been skating here for about, I don't know, 10 minutes, and there's, there's nothing really. At least not comparable to over here where the shoes are. But you know, what can you do? So on to the next court. Look at him over there logging the damage. Court number two, we're gonna see how long this one lasts. Pretty much all the people that I used to skate with are either moved out or working. So a lot of this is gonna have to be filmed selfie mode or with a tripod because pretty much everyone that films me is in LA. They painted this here line the exact same height as a tennis net so you can practice your tennis strokes. But that also means I can practice my ollies. Perfect timing for a siren to go off. There was no one here when I got here, but now I'm being taken over. This is Mike, everybody, do a trick. You're on the spot. <laughs> all right, all right, I got you right here. I'm gonna do like five tricks in a row. <laughs> Oh, your sponsors don't like it when you land stuff? Can't be landing stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ow. So in order to give us more options, we decided we were gonna try hippie jumps. He had an idea to use his knife to pin, pin up the net. Micah, show me your idea. Some people might not consider an ollie a trick, and in a game of skate, you're probably right, but I think over this tennis net, I'm gonna count it as a trick. Fire and 
Micah, do you think I can ollie from this line to that line? No. I'm six feet. So if I'm six feet with no beanie, I don't think this is the most accurate form of measurement. Sure it is. <laughs> Was that two of me or what? Definitely two of you. First try. What do you think now, huh? Huh? <laughs> All right, dude, your turn. Let me go get my board. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I did it, right? I cleared that white line, right? Yeah, yeah, for sure. I didn't know they installed this manual pad here at the skate park. Oh, wow. Sick, right? You didn't scrape. Oh. Oh. Do you think I can like power slide up it into a manual or something? I don't know if you can get over that. It's only like a foot. Get like a low angle so you can see how high it is. Is an ender. <laughs> is an ender. Congratulations. Thanks. I landed it you landed it. Yes. Oh. Oh. Cause we want to, want to